sure that all the latches of the needles are open. Draw approximately 18 inches of wire, being sure that the wire is coming off the spool smooth. through the cylinder, capturing the wire in the center of the web. off the latches while being sure to apply gentle downward pressure with the pull hook. It is very important to refer to your operating manual for the electrical input required for your machine. Be sure to remove all tools and parts from the machine surface. Lower the head cover in position prior to turning your machine on. Turn your machine on, being sure that the speed dial is set between 10 or 20 percent. Also, it's very important to constantly provide gentle downward pressure with the pull hook. Run the machine until there's enough knitted material to feed through the takedown system. Machine off, manually feed the knitted mesh through the takedown as shown here. It's important to note that excessive pull will cause rips or tears in the knitted wire, whereas too little pull will cause the knitted mesh to clog at the surface of the cylinder. Refer to your operating manual for the recommended takedown speed setting for your wire. It's important to note that depending on the stitch length setting, you may need to adjust the takedown speed. Be sure that the spool flange is free of burrs or cracks. The wire path to the knitting head must be smooth and direct. The purpose of a latch guard is to prevent the latches from popping shut when the needle comes up to cast off position. The position of a latch guard is very important. Be sure that when the needles are at cast off position that the latches are not allowed to close. Also confirm that the latch guard does not interfere with the natural opening of a latch as the stitches slide off the latches. The latch guard should also not touch the hooks of the needles.
A sinker is used to help aid the takedown. The bottom surface of the sinker helps keep the needed mesh at the surface of the cylinder. Position the sinker so that the outside diameter of the bottom edge of the sinker is tangent to the back sides of the needles as they are riding to cast off. It's important that the sinker does not push out the needles beyond the cylinder. Position the yarn guide so that the wire is fed into the needle hooks at or above the pivot point of the latch. Thank you.